99.5 V X. Rocking out backstage with the boys of Three Days Grace at Carolina Rebellion, fellas. Welcome back to North Carolina. Glad to be here. Now, uh, this is a very, uh, a very different approach to North Carolina for uh, Three Days Grace. The new lineup, a lot of big changes in the uh, recent past. How's the transition been? It's been overwhelmingly positive, you know. Um, it's a new, it's a new chapter for us. Uh, there's a new energy, uh, you know. I guess a rejuvenation, and and uh, you know, yeah, it was it was a it was a big thing to, to happen to us, uh, unexpected, uh, three days before Christmas. But but uh, you know, we were we uh, we were able to just kind of keep going. We've always been a collaborative band as far as songwriting and as far as energy, and we're a family. So having. Uh, Brad's brother Matt uh, step in and, right. and uh, he's rocking it and the fans are like fans are going crazy about it um, people are on this journey with us and uh, and he's you know he's no stranger to the festival and arena crowd he's uh, he's, right. he's done it and uh, he's just ripping through he's ripping the songs and uh, we're already writing together and we've written in the past and you know he, he grew up with us so excellent yeah I think you just answered every question yeah, I had yeah. to ask all right see you later take it easy <laughs> Now, uh, obviously, uh, being your brother in the band now, have, have you guys were, uh, done music before? Have you, you know, performed at all together, or just uh, never, man? We've never been in the same band. You know, we've always kind of written together, and you know, Matt's written on a lot of our stuff before, and uh, he's always been that pesky kid in the basement. You know, <laughs> we got six years between us. So when we were jamming, you know, back in the day, he was like ten or something. You know. No wait, are you the younger brother, or the older brother? I'm older, man. I'm yeah. six years older than my little brother too. Yeah. yeah so Did you give him wedgies, noogies? Oh yeah, I've, I've beat I've beat the crap out of him already. Indian so. sunburns. Yeah, we're we're done with it's the fighting. It's great being an older brother. We're done with the fighting now so it's all good <laughs> now uh, you just said you're already working on new material uh, you know is there is there something in the foreseeable future already or you know is there will we see something new tonight or no you know we're always working man we got a little studio in the back lounge and uh, you know we've already written three or four songs already with Matt and uh, it's just been great we're always working we're always collaborating with each other and it's just kind of an open process uh, you know we're, we're excited for the future really excellent yeah. now uh, if you do uh, I, you know I heard you guys talking earlier that uh, Matt you know still getting acclimated to the band and nothing's you know ink paper official once things are official you know is it going to continue on as three days grace or you know my darkest grace or just completely new thing or how are you uh, how, how's the approach to that well no i mean three days grace is three days grace and we and and like we, we've always been a family it's never been about you know one person or whatever uh right. we've always like we're all i mean as far as songwriting and the musicianship we're all multi-instrumentalists so we can we play everything we collaborate together we all write lyrics we all write music right and so you know the, our body of work so far is representative of i guess all of our lives you know throughout the last uh, decade and uh so you know that that process does hasn't changed and right. we've always written about real things in our lives and like right. brad said I mean, Matt, Matt co-wrote on our first record 11 years ago, and he also co-wrote on Transit of Venus. So for us to just keep writing, it's like nothing's really changed. I mean, you know, and, and he just brings this youthful energy and this, this aggression and, and real kind of vibe to the stage and it's it's pretty rejuvenating and the, I mean as you'll see probably tonight the crowd is just is, is down with it, it, it with this new energy and it's it's exciting you know? that's excellent has there been any hazing have you guys given him hell while you're out on the road yet no, I, we're, not yet no we will, we will. we're gonna let him get a little more comfortable and then we'll start uh, giving him some wedgies again and so, yeah. <laughs> now you've been really quiet today I have one question before we wrap things up how do you keep the beard so glorious <laughs> It is nice, isn't it? No, it it is beautiful. I don't know. I don't know. Do, you, do you condition? I can't reveal my secrets. I'll well, have to kill you. Yeah, there you go. I don't want to die today, so we're done with the beard talk. <laughs> Guys, Three Days Grace, the new album, Transit of Venus. Check them out live. They're out on the road, kicking ass, taking names. Three Days Grace. Thanks, man. Thanks.